time. Um, yeah, thank you for uh, having me. I'm so glad I get to do this panel discussion. So just, just quickly, he already said it with Samba. I'm a huge fan of what's going on here. Um, the, the way to go forward in the state of Wisconsin is certainly collaboration. He's absolutely right with Samba Biosciences. We saw it firsthand that because of NGOM, people like Kathy Collins really connecting us. Uh, I love it that a company in Madison's hooking up with the UW Wisconsin Oshkosh and a product, a nutraceutical product, could be coming out of Spooner, Wisconsin. That's the way the state needs to be operating. We need to be collaborating with one another. Um, you know, I've only been in this job for two months. Um, private industry going into a government. It's supposed to be a public-private corporation. Um, I've been kind of naive. It's a little more political than I ever expected, but I'm getting there. I've been in, I reprimanded a couple times, and I'm sure there'll be many more times. But um, what it has been interesting for me is that we all know we're politically divided in this state. Um, I've been a little shocked about, as I've been traveling around the state, how divided we are against communities. That a strike against me is because I'm from Madison. And it really shocks me as I go to Green Bay or Claire and some of these places and they're like, well, oh my God, you're from Madison or I hate Milwaukee or whatever. And you know what I say to them? I say, stop it. <laughs> you know, I don't care what your politics is, but we are not going to progress in this state unless we start coming together. And this is a perfect example of how we have to come together in this state, working between public public um, institutions, and you're seeing it, uh, Carl mentioned it, with Madison, Milwaukee, I'm seeing it in the engineering areas are coming together. I was over in Milwaukee area that you're seeing Concordia, Medical College of Wisconsin, they're coming together. They're seeing you can't do this stuff alone anymore. This state has to keep propelling that attitude forward. And I may be extremely naive on this point, but I hope I can be a part of that and help drive that in my position with entrepreneurship and innovation. So a little bit about WEDC quickly. And um, I don't know everything because, again, I've only been on the job for two months, but this is how I see it. Um, it was Department of Commerce, which you may have known. And I just want to let you know one thing. There were outstanding people in Department of Commerce, absolutely outstanding. I worked with those people. What was wrong were not the people, it was the structure. Okay, and so they're trying to fix it, just like so many states in this nation have recognized that, that you have to do it differently with economic development. So they've done that with the Wisconsin Economic Development Corporation. Our mission is then, one of them is to really kind of align our resources. Let's start collaborating, let's start pulling together. And again, regionally, we have to empower those regions, right? They have their own economic development. We have to empower that. But we also still have to come together as a state. And so that is one of our missions, is to try and pull that together. And in my division, um, I'm certainly not the innovator. I have a finance degree. I only pretended to know science at Novagen and also SEMBA. So I admire all the scientists in this room. But it really is for my division then, how can I align the entrepreneurial activities that are happening in this state how can I help accelerate the entrepreneurs and back the people that are really implementing programs? Not talking about it. Let's stop talking about things in this state and let's start doing it. Just like these panelists up here are going to tell you. They're the ones that are making things happen and let's start pushing this stuff. So I am a huge supporter of this and I will do whatever I can. And of course I have, little, I have some programs behind me to help me from our debt structure, our debt programs. Hopefully I'll get some equity someday as well as our tax credits that help um, our investors really give incentive to some of these companies. So I hope I can help advance some of the things in Wisconsin. Um, I may fail some along the way, but that's OK. I think with a lot of people that are in this room, people like M. John, BioForward, Wisconsin Tech Council, there's all kinds of people. Let's start moving the state forward. And again, I'm, I'm just so proud to be a part of this program and a part of these companies that are really driving entrepreneurship, startup, innovation in the state, and I'll do anything possible. I sound like a politician right now. Anything possible to make it happen.